Hello everyone. And here we go with day five. <laughs> so <clears throat> kind of expanding on yesterday's theme of balance. Today we're going to take it from this balancing breath to physically balancing. So I do always say that balancing is probably 80% mental and 20% physical. So what we're really going to try to do today is focus our minds on one point. Try to shut out all other thoughts. Just bring your attention to one thing, to one point, and use that focal point, that focus, to keep you steady in these balancing poses. All right. So we'll start coming up. <clears throat> Taking our feet about hip distance apart, let's just start with a few balances to kind of get into it, get used to the movement, get used to the feeling of that steadiness, that strength. So I'm going to find mountain pose. So we have gone through this before. I'm going to start at the feet, spread the toes nice and wide, planting them back down onto the mat, rooting through the soles of the feet. Little micro bend in the knees, activating those quadriceps, all the legs, protecting our joints, lifting up from the hips all the way up into the torso. Roll the shoulders back, <sighs> palms facing forward, gaze lifted. Let's take a few breaths here. Nice. All right, then opening your eyes, finding one point in front of you to focus on. What we're gonna do is just for three rounds, we're gonna inhale rising up onto our toes, we're gonna exhale lowering back down. And on the last one, we're going to hold for a little while. All right, so find your balance, find your focus. And as you inhale, let's rise up onto the toes. And exhale, slowly lowering back down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Last one to hold. So we inhale all the way up. Activate those legs, activate the core, focus on your point, really breathing and holding here. And exhale, slowly lowering back down. Beautiful, maybe shaking our feet. Loosen them up, maybe flipping the toes over. Try not to sickle your ankles, but let them go directly over the big toe. All right. So with that little warm-up of balancing, we're going to move into tree pose, one of the most classic yoga poses there is. So let's start with our left leg. We're going to shift our weight into our left foot, again rooting through that foot, micro bend in the knees, activate that leg. Find your gaze, find that point. All right. We're going to lift the right heel and turn the knee out to the side so that the heel comes to rest against the ankle, toes just gently on the floor. All right. So again, with your palms facing forward, your gaze focused, you can start with this. This is phase one. So finding balance here and just every now and then lifting the toes off the mat, finding your balance and then using your toes again to hold you when you need that support. Nice deep breaths. All right, moving into phase two, you can start to slide the heel up to rest against the calf. So the heel is below the knee. Again, trying to keep that openness in the hips, the knee going out towards the side. Gaze is forward. Here, really important, try not to sink into this hip, but keep pressing out through the ground so that you're really lifting up here. All right, nice and open, finding your focus. Keep your gaze on that one point. your practice you can reach up grab the ankle and send the heel up into the inner thigh right making sure that the toes are above the knee we don't want to ever press the foot against the knee because it's a hinge joint it doesn't go that way <laughs> so let's again keep the hips nice and open the knee pointing out to the side gaze is steady breathing is even strong through that standing leg let's join the palms at the heart Finding your balance. 
Again, it's that mental sharpness, that mental focus that keeps you so steady here. Let's inhale, starting to move. We're going to inhale our arms up over the head, coming into this full tree pose. Keeping your hands in this prayer position, holding it above your head. Shoulders away from the ears. Mm. And let's inhale, unfurling the branches of the tree, opening the arms out to the side. Exhale, release the hands and release the foot. Oh, coming back to both your feet here, taking a moment to really feel gratitude for both of your feet and the balance that you so naturally have. Rooting down through the right foot, shifting over to the right, micro bend in the knee, strengthen the leg. Lift the heel, placing it against the ankle, turning the knee out. Again, not sinking into the hip, but keep lifting up, stacking on top of the foot there. <sighs> Phase one. Deciding if you feel comfortable here. And holding steady. Maybe sliding up to phase two, heel is below the knee, resting against the calf, or phase three, lifting the heel up to the inner thigh, toes are above the knee again, opening the knees away, opening the hips, gaze is steady, breathing is even, finding your focus. Join the palms of the heart. Breathing deeply. Start to move. So we're lifting the prayer position of our hands up to above our head. We're dropping the shoulders away from the ears. of the tree, opening out the arms and releasing the foot, coming back to your mountain pose, nice and steady in this posture, let's take three deep breaths, gratitude for our balance, inhale, and out, deep breath in, and out. Last one, let's fill, take the deepest breath we've taken all day. Inhale, a little deeper, and sigh it out. <sighs> Feeling that clarity in your thoughts, balance in your body, and letting that keep with you for the rest of the day. I wish you a beautiful day. Namaste.